Palestinian Heritage Trail launches the project to increase economic opportunities and improve livelihoods for local communities along the trail in the West Bank, funded by the Japanese Social Development Fund through the World Bank. Agreements have been signed with 15 service providers along the path. Today, we are delighted to begin implementing the project by taking a practical step forward after three years of preparation and activation of the institutions operating along the Palestine Heritage Trail, with the support of the Palestinian Ministry of Tourism, which is working on developing community-based tourism. We have been working with the World Bank for four years to reach the implementation phase with the support to develop local community institutions working in the field of tourism. The Ministry of Tourism and Antiquities expressed its happiness with the achievement and implementation of this project, which is part of the Ministry's efforts to develop tourism by activating new tourism programs and models, such as desert, environmental, and community tourism. This project comes within the framework of the efforts, work, and vision of the Palestinian Ministry of Tourism and Antiquities to develop tourism and open avenues for promoting Palestine in various sectors. We aim to go beyond religious tourism, in which a lot has already been accomplished. We are working on activating other tourism programs and patterns such as desert tourism, environmental tourism, and community-based tourism as part of our policies and programs for developing tourism through a focus on cultural heritage in Palestine. Palestinian Heritage Trail also mentioned that the selection of winning initiatives and projects in the first phase took place through transparent procedures and criteria with the guidance committee consisting of official and civil entities. A total of 266 initiatives applied for the grant, and today 15 grants have been approved. I am fortunate to be part of the steering committee formed by the Ministry of Tourism, Bethlehem University, the management of the trail, and the Ministry of Environment. Those who have been selected for the grant are lucky to be the first to receive funding to expand and develop tourism services, achieving community and national tourism development. Some institutions and individuals benefiting from the initiatives have provided explanations about their initiatives, stating that this project will contribute to enhancing their work in community tourism. Our initiative focuses on developing an authentic Arabian horse stable and organizing tours in the Jerusalem desert for tourists, contributing to enhancing the Palestinian presence in the Jerusalem desert and Bethlehem. This project will contribute to the development of the concept of the horse stable. We extend our gratitude to the Palestine Heritage Trail, the Japanese Social Development Fund, and the World Bank for choosing our tourism initiative. This project is important and vital, and it will help me develop and expand my guest house after the increase in the number of local and international tourists on the trail in the Northern West Bank. This grant will contribute to enhancing and developing the guest house, renovating it. I thank the Palestine Heritage Trail and everyone who stood by me and supported me. This project represents an additional qualitative leap for the development of Palestinian tourism. It will also contribute to increasing economic opportunities and improving livelihoods for communities along the Palestinian Heritage Trail.